Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the uplink module and its ports in a 3650 switch when you are using a packet tracer. Using a Cisco 3650 switch is a little different than using other switches like 3560 or 2960 switch in packet tracer. Because 3650 is a modular switch and you have to add all these modules individually to make them available for you to configure those ports. So let me show you how it works. So I am going to select a 3650 switch. I'm going to add one more switch so, you, so we can interconnect them and see how it works. So if you look at this switch, go to CLI, it says device must be powered on because it's a modular switch. It doesn't come with the power. So you have to add this power, you have to insert this power into those power slots. And then let me do that to other switch and come back to the first one. By the time I go there, it will be powered on. So let me go here, go to CLI. Yes, it is powered on now. So I'm going to go into the enable mode and I'm going to see the ports available here. Show in, show in status. If you see here, it's a 24 port switch and I have all my access ports, one to 24. And I also have this gig 111 to 114. This is an uplink module. If you go to the physical view and you will see those this is the uplink module. But when you go to connect the cable, you are not going to see any ports available in the uplink module. And let's see how it goes. So I'm going to go to select a connection cable. I'm going to select something automatically, choose the connection type. And then I'm going to go to this switch and then going to connect here and then going to select my ports and if you see here i don't have the gig 111 available and let me put back to the original port and go back here and see and same situation here so let me go back to 11101 and see how to add these ports so click here and go to the physical view and go here it's like a power supply and you come and click here and you go to this uplink module this is a thousand base uh, tsfp and add all these ports here and you see now only you see the ports and i will do the same thing to this one and go to here Add these ones, second, third, and fourth. I all, so I have all four ports available now. And now I go here and select a uplink port. Now it is available, gig 111. And I will do the same thing to this one and it's going to take a few seconds. So let me go back and pause this. Okay, now these uplink ports are green, so they are connected now. So this is how you add uplink ports and the module to a Cisco 3650 switch in the packet tracer environment. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to my channel and don't forget to share and comment on the video also turn on the notifications so you will be notified when i release my next video all right thanks bye